According to Paul Raber, professor of psychology at Northwestern University, the human brain can store an estimated 2,500,000 gigabytes. That's equivalent to 300 years worth of TV shows. Research shows that the average attention span has decreased by an average 12 minutes over the last 10 years. Today, the human attention span is shorter than a goldfish. Time studies have even shown some links between device multitasking. For example, if you're scrolling through social media while watching TV, and declining attention spans. On average, the adult brain weighs 3 pounds. For reference, this is comparable to how much a cantaloupe weighs. Neuroscientists have known for a long time that the hippocampus stores short-term memories. However, a recent study revealed that while short-term memories are formed in the hippocampus, they are simultaneously stored in another part of the brain for long-term memories. Vitamin B1 is essential to producing the brain chemical acetylcholine, which is needed for concentrating and storing memories. An Australian study revealed that those who consumed B1 supplements and folic acid for two years improved long and short-term memory. Being able to quickly access information, i.e. via our borderline invincible internet, actually makes it harder to remember. The harder we work to access data, the more likely we are to remember. Memories start forming in the womb, as this is a critical time for brain development. Memory recall can occur as early as 4 months into pregnancy. The brain uses 20% of the body's total oxygen and energy which travels to the brain through blood vessels. Nerve cells in the brain need a lot of energy, without adequate oxygen and energy to the central nervous system tissue, one can suffer impaired brain functions and neurological disorders. The brain is 73% water. It only takes 2% dehydration to affect your attention and memory. An hour and a half of sweating can temporarily shrink brain size as much as one year of aging does. Five minutes without oxygen can lead to brain cells dying, which causes brain damage. The brain generates between 12 and 25 watts of electricity, that's enough to power a low wattage light bulb. Neurons travel 150 miles per hour in the brain. Different types of neurons move at different speeds, for example, pain signals move much slower than other ones. Those who take a quiz after its revision are 65% more likely to remember the facts. When we learn something new, our brain forms new connections between neurons, this then increases visible gray matter in the brain. Memory is prioritized by emotion. But this also means that a lot of our memories are unintended flawed fiction. Similarly to the above fact, emotions drastically alter our brains. The chemical reactions stirred by feelings can be physically seen in brain scans and studies of gray matter. The average brain has between 50,000 and 70,000 thoughts a day. Upsettingly, the majority, an estimated 60 to 70 percent, of the thoughts are negative. With roughly 100 billion brain cells, more than 100,000 chemical reactions take place in the brain every second. When intoxicated, the brain is incapable of forming memories. So no, you didn't forget what happened last night. The memory simply was never formed. 